Salutations everybody, welcome to or welcome back to another episode of Kirby and the Forgotten Lands. So, I didn't start off in the game yet because I don't know if what's going to be different. One thing I can say for certain is that we see Quarreline on top of the towers, but also we now have another gotcha machine for us. so there's that too. Oh, we have some concerts, seriously, this is why I just wanted to save this beginning because... Hey, now we're in the, I guess, the, the second story, I guess you want to say it, whatever it would actually be considered to be called. Oh, and it looks like we have another uh, uh, Coliseum challenge as well, the Ultimate Cup. So I wonder if that means we're going to be able to get other copy abilities as well. And we see DDD on the side over there. I didn't even read what the text said, I just saw him up there. <laughs> so that means we will talk to him soon enough. But also, Coraline actually beckoned us up top of the tower. But before we do so, my goodness, we jumped from 51% to 70% completion. My goodness, I didn't even realize how long that last segment was. But anyways, before we then explore the rest of the town, we are just going to go up here. So hey girl, what's up? Oh, I see another vortex thing, I believe is what it's called. Wait, right, Evelyn? Is this another mysterious vortex? What? He sends Leon Guard somewhere in there. Oh yeah, I was also going to mention that with him, we saw him at the very end of the credits, or at least I saw him. Screenshot of it, so I'll put it up in the corner somewhere over here. It said, to be continued. <laughs> so I just thought I was, that was kind of interesting. Oh, oh I like how even she got started. Out. Okay, looks like we're not going to say hello to DDD right away. We're just going to be sucked in here, apparently. Oh my gosh. This is a feeling. This is exactly how it felt when I was absorbed by the other half of Fecto Alphilus. It is, it's possible that after the big battle, Leongard became trapped in a strange place. Come on, Kirby. We have to check it out. That we will do. So that probably means that he wasn't actually bad, that he probably was getting controlled unwillingly, which I think is really interesting. That's probably always happened to King DDD as well. Oh, forego planes. Okay, well I guess before we go and explore more of you know Waddle Town, we may as well go in here. So let's do this into forego planes. We go, babies. Also, no copy abilities. So I wonder if this is going to be the same, only slightly different than you know the rest of the levels, or if there's going to be completely new levels. But also, we able to suck you in, dude. And it was that thought too. I wonder if there's going to be more treasure roads to do, because one thing that was also mentioned before like, I pause and cut to where we were. You got a piece of Le Leon's soul. Wait, is this Leon's soul? It must be a tiny fragment of it. If you collect more of these scattered souls, you might be able to save him. Try to collect more pieces of Leon's souls as you can to explore the isolated isles of Forgo Streams. Will do. <laughs> but anyways, I was going to say that... Apparently you could make the copy abilities even stronger. I don't know how that would work for us, but we'll find out soon enough. But also we got this down here. And is there going to be Waddleys or something down here, or are they all just going to be Forgo Souls? So that's going to be something that we're going to be figuring out as we go. Oh, we got these here. So I'm glad that we actually picked up the Hammer Kirby so we could get another soul. So yeah, that looks like we're going to just be collecting hidden souls as not Waddle anymore? Don't really know. Because there was still a lot of Waddle Dees that were in the factory. So I kind of have to wonder if those are still a part of the, the game or not. Outside of course the non forgo land area. And ooh, more switch areas. <laughs> This one was sneaky. I was like, I don't think it's gonna be that far considering all the other little, like, you know, I guess puzzles if you want to call them that, but all the pieces were never that far away from each other. And ooh, I like how there's like bunches of them, not just like one individual ones. Oh, so yes, hello, dude. I'm gonna suck you in now because I have a feeling that we're gonna be needing you for something. Just like that switch down there, which we could have missed, but thankfully we did not. I actually really like this, how it's like a bit more speedy, but you still gotta be really paying attention. I don't know which one we're going to use, 
So we'll just go to Japan and see which we get more towards, which just so happened to be this. Okay, let's go. And now I'm guessing it's mini boss time. Wild Bonkers. Interesting, and I like how some of the enemies in here are possessed and some of them aren't. At least as far as I know of. Like, this dude looks like he's a, you know, a forgo. I don't know if you want to call them, like, minions or not, but still. And get wrecked. And I would take you, but I kind of want to keep this because I really like Spike Kirby. I guess in this case, Crystal Needle Kirby, but come on, he's still spiky. <laughs> yeah, like this dude over here doesn't look like he actually is one of the, the, the Shadow Forgo versions. I don't really know what they would be considered, but I think that's just really interesting. Now, I don't know which side we actually need to go if we need to go up here to the side. Nope. Looks like we don't need to go up here, except for we would lose what I would say would be Waddledees, but it's actually the souls in this case. And another gotcha pop, which looks like it's first of the blue ones, but also we see this down here, of course, but I'm guessing just to get up here? Don't really know, is. I have a feeling that there's going to be more souls in here that we can't get, but for now, we will just move on and we will figure that all out later. Lots of very happy bomb dudes? <laughs> I don't actually know what these enemies are called, but I kind of love them, but also feel bad for them, because they literally just are there to exist, to blow up. Just like, bruh. And now we got this area, which I don't know if we need to get all these switches at once, and it does not look like that. So that's good, otherwise it'd be like, bruh, what do you try to do for us? Do we need to save Ranger Kirby for all of this? No, please get that back. Thank you. I also really like this ability too, because it's very helpful for just attacking enemies, although it sucks because it just blew up the sword ability there. Now we're just gonna run with a few bombs over here, apparently. <laughs> now get a little bombs. You, you do what you do, buddy. So Try to get both of these switches, and whew, I'm glad that we were able to do that before we got squished. And it's still surprised that there's nothing down here for us. Well, now there actually is, because we see that there's uh, one of the... Leon souls down here, which I don't know if we just if we could get back up. Oh, looks like we collected all the pieces of Leon's soul in this spot. Let's check the next area. Okay, sweet. I was worried that we actually missed some, so I guess that area is just blocked off for whatever reason. Oh, and it brought us back to the mall, so I I guess that some of these ones are literally just combining all the ones that we have done before. Now I hope that we didn't need an ability. I guess we do, but who needs an ability where you just suck up giant rabbits like that? <laughs> it's like, bruh. But what does this do first? Okay, it actually gave us something good. I was gonna be like, if it was all just to go back to that enemy, I would have been like, bruh. No, we missed a soul because I didn't get up to it at the time. So I wonder if it would be better to just, like, get something like Bomb Kirby over here or something. That's just too bad because I don't think we can actually get back here once we get to the next area it, to get it. And now let's see what this one gives us. So I wonder if this also goes to just be one like pop figure that we can get per level or not. I also kind of like how right there you actually have to go against the current and not with install. Yeah we can't go back but we we can go here at least. Oh yeah say we got another mouthful mode. It's really weird not having a mouthful mode especially saying we like, all the episodes before the last one just had that many. I don't know which way we're really supposed to go. Are you guys really just going to like heat off? Oh, at least we got more than just coins there. It's gonna be like, if that was all for coins, big bro moment. I love how you can just bring home Mouth Kirby down here. Now we get to do a surprise attack that dude who thought he could get away from us by leaving up here. Squish! And Mega Squish because. We don't want you buddies, and now here is actually really scary. No! <laughs> oh, we have a star here. 
So I guess that answers my question if we can get more things like treasure roads. And we made it to the end of this. It's too bad we missed just that one. That would have been that last one. So now I'm assuming this is going to be the last half. I don't really know. Also crazy how long this area is too. Oh ho ho! We get to do a refight. Although this time, I don't know if we have Sword Kirby or not. We can't go back, so we don't have Sword Kirby to fight with them. So I wonder if it's going to be similar to, you know, having like the hidden qualities if if you have extra, if you get extra souls in order to get like a time thing or not. His eyes are really trippy. I actually really like this because in neon, it's like neon colors, and neon colors are actually one of my favorite ones to do. So this boss is going to end up being really awkward, so apologies for that ahead of time. <laughs> Oh, and it looks like we're on to phase two. And I did actually have a cutscene there, so there's that. And that was the last hit. Sadly, it wasn't worth Parcupine Crystal Kirby, but you know what? A. It is what it is. And that means we had made it to the end. Only having one remaining, at least I would assume so. Oh, it is still here, and I will take that back. Thank you very much. <laughs> she really like it. I guess it's a neat look, and I also really like crystals. When I was a kid, I used to actually have little crystals in a bag. So let's see if it really was that one that we missed. Oh, no, we missed ten more. Dang. Well, seven more technically, but still. My goodness, that's a lot. But now we are actually going to go back to Bottle D Town, and if there's something in between there that is worth to look at, I'll keep it in. And here we are, and it also looks like Chlorine is now long longer there. Oh, I like how worried he is. It's just like, bruh, that's so cute, even though he like, took ya, but it's like not purposely. Hey, what's up, dude? How do you do, Kirby? Would you like to hear the latest info from around the world? Ah, Kirby! King DDD has a blueprint, is it in town? The most popular Bottle D Cafe items are Maximum Tomatoes, and that will be that. Now thank you, sir. Well, it's a good thing that we're gonna be off talking to DDD. Also, don't worry, we are also going to kill because we're gonna have Kirby and Elfland's gonna have a nice lunch. But first, I want to talk to the boy. There he is. Hiya, Kirby. <laughs> Aw, oh, Mini and Waddle Dee, that's so cute, oh my gosh, it's so cute, I love King DDD, I love the Waddle Dee's, it just makes me so happy. <laughs> Hiya Kirby, it's been a while, hasn't it? I didn't get to say this before, so thanks for singing, saving King DDD. Speaking of, he seems to really like this town. He is in a resting spot for himself to heal. Actually, we have something to give you, a blueprint from King DDD. A gift from the king, what an honor. Aw. Oh. Thanks, DD, appreciate that. Ooh, a masked hammer blueprint. So that answers my question. There's probably going to be some blueprints hidden around for us to grab as well. So lots of things to look forward to. And now we're just trying to find the lunch area so we can actually heal. So hello, my dear friend. I would like to get ourselves a burger because I think that's absolutely adorable. And the Kirby's also going to sleep. So we're actually going to leave it off with him sleeping because I think that would be really cute. Helps and to actually get lunch and not have it to go. Which works for us anyways. I'd just like to buy it, please. Would you just like to eat it here? Thank you very much. Actually, I think we will just leave it here because this is also really cute. So thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I didn't even realize how long that one level is going to take, so we got a lot of things to look forward to. An A. Heals and no longer looking worried. We can also fish some more, because that's also really fun. But there we go. With that, shall I leave it here? So thank you for watching, I hope you enjoyed. If you liked this video, please give it a big thumbs up, slap the subscribe button, do what you do, and I will see you in the next video. Peace.